Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum dear students. Hope you all are doing well. Uh, students, I welcome you in the English lesson of class 4. So, before starting today's lesson, let's have a recap of the previous lessons. In the previous lesson, what we did, that was unit 2 and word study page. We did here, we put here the correct word in front of all these actions, all these verbs. Then in exercise B, that was vocabulary, we had to categorize the words accordingly. So the categories were meat, alphabet, swimwear, flower, vessels, colors, home. Hope you all are clear about it. Now let's move towards today's exercise. This is exercise C. Let's read the question. Question is word structure. How many syllables in each word? Okay, students. So uh, maybe this will be a little difficult for you that what is syllable. So let's read the definition of syllable first. So you must be clear about the syllables are a unit of pronunciation having one vowel sound with or without surrounding consonants forming the whole or a part of a word. Hope you all can see this definition. Okay, now I will explain it to you how and what is syllable. This syllable is actually how long the word is. How long the word is and then we have to split it into pieces. But in each part, it will have a vowel sound. Remember, not the vowel, but every part will have the vowel sound. Okay, let's do the exercise, then you will be more clear about it. The example which is already given to you, that is rabbit. That is rabbit. Okay, let me explain it to you. First, we split it into two parts. ra bit Again, ra bit Okay, students, if you see in ra, what sound it is? A. So, A is what? A is a vowel. Bit. In bit, we have a sound. That is I. So, these both are vowels. These both are vowels. So, here we have two syllables. If we can split a word into two pieces and in both of the parts have the vowel sound, it means that it has two syllables. Let's do the next word. That is fox. Fox. We can't split this word because already this is a short word. Fox. So it has a sound. A is vowel. So it has one syllable. The next word is frozen. So what you can do with a pencil, you can split them like frozen. These two are in, this word is in two parts. So fro. In fro, we have a sound. Zen, we have a sound. So, you can split it like this. Fro, zen. So, it has two syllables. In the next word, the next word is evening. You can also split it in two parts. Eve. In Eve, we have a sound. It is vowel. The next part, Ning. In Ning, we have a, I. This is also a vowel. So it has two syllables. Eve, Ning. Eve, Ning. Okay, the next word is. 
recently recently in recently we have three parts re sent li so in re we have e sound one syllable sen again e sound and li students remember y is not a vowel but it gives us the sound of vowel that is e y is pronounced as e when it comes at the end of the word so re sent li so how many vowels we have we have three syllables in that in three parts we have three vowel sounds fish fish is a single word we can't split it like fi or sh because it gives uh, it does not make any sense fish is one word so it has only one vowel sound a a so fish it has one syllable number 7 is fisher men fi sure men okay fi e sound e so one syllable sure o sound here e is gi giving a sound men men e is giving e sound fi sure men so it has three syllables fi sure men the next is dolphin doll o sound o is vowel fin e fin is e is vowel so it has two syllables doll fin doll fin okay number 9 is mammal me mal this is a sound this is a sound a o both are vowel sounds so there are two syllables giant jai int if we split it so we will split it like g i separately ant separately so here i i this is the sound of vowel and ant a a is the sound of vowel so giant it has two syllables ha p li ha in ha we have a sound p here e sound e is a vowel and li li again i told you students that y is not vowel but y gives us the sound of vowel so we will count it as a syllable ha p li so it has three syllables kit ten in kit we have a sound ten we have un sound o o is also the sound of vowel a is also the sound of vowel kit ten so it has two syllables this can be split into two parts this word and it has two syllables so here you have to write two so hope students you are clear about today's exercise you need to practice it more and more